So real quick, I want to plug my Instagram account. The link is in the description, Big J's Extreme Fitness. Click on that and it'll take you to my Instagram. And here is actually a picture uh, of me at Intensiveville just a couple of days ago doing legs on the leg extension. And then after I was chilling, I had my legs up on the dumbbell rack. But I post, a lot of people say, work out in a tank top, work out in shorts. I just don't do that. I've already put videos up that I let the intensity do all the talking. I'm just not big on wearing tank tops when I work out. So I do post pictures on Instagram, progress pictures and after workout pictures and whatnot. So again, follow me on Instagram and you'll be able to see pictures like that that you're looking for and you're interested in seeing. Check it out. What's up, Internet? Jason in this with Big J's Extreme Fitness. I wanted to repost this squat video, uh, and I've got two squat videos to put up. So here's the first one. Check it out. That was a video I posted a couple of weeks ago, and that was the very first time I was underneath a squat bar in three months, okay? I incurred an injury during an altercation at work on my back, and I just could not put any weight on my back. Leg pressing plenty of weight and extending and curling and whatnot, but I just couldn't put any weight on my back. So uh, the, a lot of the comments were, oh, Big J, you're almost there. Your depth is not quite where it used to be. The cameraman was standing up behind me. And so you couldn't really see the death. But if you look in the mirror, if you need to go back to the video, watch it again. But looking in the mirror, you can see my hamstrings. Now, if I was barely going parallel, you wouldn't be able to see my hamstrings, especially at a higher angle. But with my hamstrings showing in the mirror, you'll see that that was definitely deep enough. Now, every time I squat, I put my hamstrings to my calves. So there's that. Now, here's this weekend's video. I did 10 reps plus one more. Uh, giving myself 11 with 405 with a pause. So check this video out real quick. Yeah! Mm. But you know as well as I do that there's going to be somebody else that squats a lot deeper. And hey, that's cool. That's the way I've been squatting for 30 years and it's worked for me so far. And that's the kind of depth that brought me legs like this. Some depth. So really proud of that set. Getting, coming back stronger. My back feels really good now. Uh, so I'll probably start increasing my weight. If I could do 10 reps with the weight, I probably need to put 20, 30, even 50 more pounds on my next uh, working set. Probably will only get about four or five reps with that increase in weight, but that's the way you increase your weight. That's the way you get stronger. That's the way you get bitter, bigger. That's the way you uh, make gains. So, and that full leg video goes up tomorrow. I may split it in half because there's probably about 20 minutes of footage. I don't want to cut a whole lot of it out. It's a lot of good footage. So until then, intensity rules, train hardcore, have an absolutely amazingly positive, intense day, and we'll see you next video. No, you're all right. All right. Thanks for the spot. Give me the camera. No problem. Good job. That's good. <laughs>